Republican strategists and commentators are taking note of how well Democrats have used early voting and ballot harvesting to their advantage. Some are blaming the GOP's disappointing midterm performance on a failure to get their supporters casting ballots early. The number one reason for that is Democrat mastery of mail-in balloting, vote harvesting, and the machinery of the early vote in these states where they're voting for weeks, if not months, before the election. We don't play the game. It's one thing to complain about the game. It's another thing that we don't play it at all. We still say, vote on election day. We don't fight for those early votes. We don't ballot harvest. We don't play the games that the Democrats play. The Republicans really have to get a hold of this early vote thing. There's no Republican early vote strategy. Can t anybody tell me what that is? Millions of Americans voted early and by mail in this election, and Democrats dominated the early vote. Democrats have also dominated the practice of ballot harvesting. That's when one individual collects completed ballots and submits them in bulk at a ballot drop box or by mail. Republicans have fought to ban the practice. In announcing his presidential campaign this week, Donald Trump said he would outlaw it. To eliminate cheating, I will immediately demand voter ID, same-day voting, and only paper ballots. But early voting and ballot harvesting remains widespread. Republicans may spend the next two years learning how to compete with Democrats on the tactical side of voting. Sarah Westwood for The Washington Examiner.